I founded the Feminist Institute to create easier access to feminist documentation and also to participate in expanding online search equity. At the Feminist Institute, we are concerned that online searches can only find what already exists on the internet and that search algorithms produce gender biased results. The Feminist Institute is working to address both issues by making more material documenting feminist contributions to culture more visible online. The New York Public Library has always been the preeminent and most used research library in the world. And our mission is to continue that and to be therefore as inclusive in our collections and making those collections as accessible as possible. We need to make sure that it's available to everyone who can come and everyone who wants to view it online. The technology now makes that possible. This partnership, the city funding makes it possible. This is our obligation. Yeah, the city funding brings this project to life and creates an exciting partnership between the New York Public Library and the Feminist Institute. And it was really exciting to be part of this uh, alongside the Speaker of the City Council to make sure that this organization can partner with the New York Public Library and bring something really exciting to life. And having seen it here today, I can tell you it was a good investment. The reason why the partnership between the TFI and the New York Public Library is so important is because we can light the way to show people why partnerships work. Too often, charities and public organizations work in silos, whereas in fact, we should be leveraging up and partnering so that we can both use our money and our resources to create something bigger than ourselves. And this is why this partnership is so exciting. And our partnership allows us to initiate content for the Feminist Institute Digital Archive with materials from a world-class public collection and allows the library to elevate feminist materials for public access. Has just reinforced our commitment to make sure that our record, our corpus is inclusive and accessible. And today in this project helps us make sure that that's the case.